And good morning and welcome on this walk. I'm uh, going from walking from Marlow in Buckinghamshire down to Hurley on Thames, which is, I guess it's still in Buckinghamshire or it might be Oxfordshire, it might be Berkshire. I'll have to check that one later. Um, yeah, but it's a lovely cold day, uh, autumnal day. Have a look at those. Leaves are falling from the trees, beautiful autumnal colours, lovely. Walk today is about five miles, so I don't know how long it's going to take. It's supposed to take about three and a half hours, um, but I'll have a lunch stop along the way. Be cool though, nice to get out and blow away the cobwebs. Okay, so now I've reached the Thames towpath and uh, yeah, there's a question I, I kind of wanted asking really was that um, all the time that I've been coming down the A404M I've seen a signpost to some, something called Temple but I've never really ventured down there to see what it actually was and I um, found out now that I don't know if you can see behind me um, but there are some houses, um, a big housing development and what is quite normal for around here which is houses built on a floodplain. This is Temple Footbridge, which was built in the late 80s to replace a passenger ferry. I guess that's the boathouse across there next to the left of the bridge. Um, yeah, so a passenger ferry that used to traverse this part of the, the River Thames. Nice sleek design. So according to the OS map, this is the remains, or possibly still is, the Benedictine Priory.
this is quite a long and very boring and very flat path. So that apparently is Bisham Abbey. Okay, so we made it back. Uh, that walk took about three hours, something like that. Um, it's supposed to be five and a half miles, but I, I don't know what happened. Some I got lost in Hurley Village. Uh, the the guidebook um, wasn't particularly um, exact about what you had to do in Hurley Village, so. Uh, yeah, that was a bit of a cock up really, um, but somehow managed to find my way back onto Hurley Lock uh, and then back onto the Thames Path. The Thames Path is a bit of a long, slow, flat trudge uh, back towards Marlow um, and it's absolutely teeming with people and absolutely teeming with dog walkers. So if, uh, if dogs kind of scare you then probably best avoided. Um, but otherwise, it was a nice, nice walk in the sunshine, in the autumn sunshine. Lovely to see the autumn colours. Um, yeah, and highly recommended. So this is uh, from the Pathfinder number 10 on the Thames Valley and Children's Guide. <laughs>